It's wonderful. Mm -hmm. Okay, so um, obviously this is not 4C texture here, and that's what people like because it's the nappiest, which, I mean, I like it too, but that's not what we're dealing with today. This is more like a 3B. This is, um, she mixed, so obviously. But this is the blow dryer technique. Um, the idea is to part the hair in small sections. Um, the smaller the section, the better your results gonna be. So instead of blow drying that whole section, I just part this into a smaller section. And I put this up. Um, so obviously the more coarse the hair, the more sections you'll have. Do I need to part her hair in this many sections? No. <clears throat> but for the sake of this tutorial video, I'm just showing y'all that you part it in small sections to blow dry it. You get a blow dryer comb. You can't do it without a blow dryer comb. You grab the hair and you stretch that first curl out. You put the blow dryer comb up to the scalp. And you don't rush through it. You have to slow down. Um, I'm sorry. Let's go back one step. You start at the ends. And you blow dry the ends first. You get the, because you want to detangle the hair. This hair is pre-detangled. You put the tension on the hair. You put the blow dryer comb into the scalp. And you use the comb to straighten the hair. This is where you get 90% of your, your straightening from. It does not come from the from the uh, flat iron, it comes from the blow dry. So like these curls right here, I'm just gonna grab and clear those and straighten that out with the blow dry. Okay, second section. Start at the end, and as you see this hair is color treated, so it's very fragile. So you want to take your time with those ends and get them detangled real gently. And then you get up to that scalp and you put the comb up against that first curl after you stretch it out to straighten that hair. Okay, that's my blow dry technique. Um, thank y'all for watching. Like, share, peace, love, stop the hate.